Hello everyone, Crydex here. Welcome back to our Elden Ring playthrough. We've been having a lot of fun. Um, in between videos, I went to the Table of Lost Grace to see if I'd missed anything. I jumped down where that dark spirit, red spirit thing was. I did find an item which I can't use. It's called a pata, cipher pata, which requires 30 faith to use, and apparently it's like a, a fist weapon. It like casts a little spell that does damage that can't be blocked. I don't know. I don't have 30 faith, so we're not going to see that for a long time. Um, but yeah, what I was looking for was a place to buy more spells, because, well... I have a second spell slot, and I would really like to fill it, and I'd like to keep kind of progressing my magic. So I figured I'd explore maybe a couple areas I haven't been to yet. I haven't been down to this beach or this beach. So we're going to see what's down here. Apparently a giant that I'm going to want to avoid. I doubt there's going to be spells down here, but it's worth checking out, I think. And then we might do some boss fight times. I desperately need to defeat the main boss, but I also thought I could do some upgrades to my greatsword. I have a decent amount of smithing stones now, and it's amazing how 10% more damage can make an impact. Now, what is this? I'm going to follow it just feels like something I should do. Can I catch it? Hmm. I wonder what this is about. Doesn't seem to do anything. Alright, so there's Land Octopus Dose over here. Ouch. Now, does this thing have a weak spot or something? Is it the tentacles on the front? There it is. Yeah, that seemed to deal some extra damage. What if I take out this one, too? Hiya! Dang it. Come on. There we go. Get off me! Oh, you just keep getting more? So then what is the easy way to kill these things? Clearly that's not bad. Oh, I can summon my ashes. Let's try this out. The Wandering Nobles. Come on, man. Nobody lives forever. Surely there's a way to deal more damage with melee weapons, and not just magic. away? Or is it just that resistant to, to this kind of damage? There we go. That seemed to do it. I guess hitting the head somehow. The beak. It's not really worth it unless I need the hand octopus things, but I don't, so. I'll just keep exploring. I'm not going to kill that one. There's a freebie, ovary. And uh, anything else of interest? 
on the beach here. What are you? Just random dudes. Oh, you've got red eyes. That makes me want to kill you. Oh, you all have red eyes. Okay. Only 44 souls. That's not very much. Can I swim? That's something I guess I don't know about the horse. I'm scared to try. Merchant. Will you sell me spells? What do you need? I don't want any trouble. Uh, you will not. You will sell boluses, though. Alleviates poison buildup, blood loss, and sleep. Cookbook expands crafting repertoire, firebone arrows, neutralizing boluses, a broadsword, which I don't really need, a short bow. Oh, I need the long bow. I'm trying to remember who sold it though. Land squirts and stone digger trolls. Okay, so I need to. Well, I guess I could just okay. sell him. I don't want any trouble. A couple things. What can I sell him? It's worth something. Um, ears. Anything worth a decent amount of money? These are all the crafting materials are worth ten. And ashes and weapons. Don't really want to sell weapons. I could sell a single short sword. And the leather shield, I think, is pretty bad. Probably will never use that. Couple helms. Because they're repeats. Okay, that's pretty much it. All done? Well, you again. I don't want any. So I do want the cookbook here, and I'll take that. I need to sell one of these for 400 so I can buy this thing. Alright. What do you got? What do you got? What do you got? Um, I've got land squirts. Are soft where they touch the ground, and poison will call them to cause them to rupture. Now, what is a land squirt? I don't even know what those are. Stone digger trolls. The heads of stone digger trolls bear old wounds. So that means their heads are vulnerable. And now I can craft fire arrows. It's not bad since I have so many smoldering butterflies. Okay, well, that's helpful. Still doesn't uh, get me what I want though, which is flipping more spells. I will keep exploring here. Oh, there's one of those boosty points. What is this? Vulnerable to magic, maybe? Yes. Oh, these are just the little blobs from Dark Souls 3. Okay, that's not all that handy. Beast bones. Item over here. And pickled foul folks. Skeletons here. Oh, 
Alright. Um, got some magic back for that. Let's jump. Wait, isn't that what I'm supposed to do? No? Yes? There we go. What the? Excuse me. That was very weird. Did I go to the right? Yeah, I wanted to go this way. Whoa! Boing. And that just takes me back to the starting area. Okay. Not that useful. We'll check the other beach. See if I can find anything of use down there. Oh, I can't double jump. You died. It's weird that you can double jump after jumping, but not after falling. It's a bit counterintuitive. Normally you can double jump when you fall as well. So that's why I just fell to my death at least. More of this direction. close. Because can I do this and then... No, it didn't let me. Interesting. So there's a certain amount of falling that prevents you from double jumping too. So it's, you know, keeps you from just jumping down a death fall and then hitting double jump at the last second. Which was totally my plan. Now, I also just realized... We can summon our little spirit dudes here. And maybe they can help me defeat giant butthead over here. They're probably all just going to get wrecked. At the very least, they do some damage. Ouch. Ouch. Hmm. I wonder if a different spirit would be better. I also got an item from a witch lady. I, I stopped by the, whatchamacallit, the merchant here, and she gave me this. Where is it? Uh, here, a spirit calling bell, a bell that summons various spirits. So I don't totally understand what the difference is, because you can't equip it. And so I'm not totally sure. What the point of it is. Or if I actually couldn't summon spirits before I had it. Because I never really tried. So I'm not sure if that unlocked the ability for me to finally summon them. Or what. So I don't. Totally understand what uh, what it's all about. It's in the key items section. So 
So I don't was I not able to summon spirits before this? If you know, let me know. Oh, also the stone sword key. Right, right, right. I keep meaning to do this. I gotta go back to my, my starting location. And use the stone sword key. And see what's on the other side of that fog. Inside this uh place. Gotta take the elevator down. Break some pots. So right here, stone sword key. Yes. Our first one. Wait, not enough. How many do I need? Screw you. It's so rude. Um, okay, well, scratch that idea. Um, I guess I haven't explored up here, have I? Let's go do that. So I go right. I really would like more, more spells. A second spell would be nice. Although, let's be honest, I probably, with my amount of intelligence, am not gonna be able to find one that's better. Did you give that I love them? Okay, I haven't even found chrysalids yet. So. You love creepy spiders, I guess? I don't totally know what she's on about. But we need to go north under the bridge here. Follow the yellow brick road. This is the way, maybe? Can't tell. Yeah, okay. So now we're on the north side of the bridge, which... Oh, will you sell me spells? You, please, I can't Creepy looking. Them. You're okay, you can see my hands. Oh, head to the foundation of gold tarnished. Traverse Rhea Lucaria, Glintstone Eventide. And reunite the half crescents at the grand lift. What does any of that mean? Oh, but the bridge is collapsed and cannot be crossed. Only why should that matter? Storm Vale Castle still stands tall. So is that Okay, no, we already did that. So that's basically telling me I can cross this bridge maybe after I win Stormville Castle? Maybe? That's the impression I'm getting. Ooh, a warrior's cookbook. What's that one do for me? Now, the cookbooks aren't actually in the inventory, are they? Oh, there they are. So that one unlocked soft cotton, stanching boluses, and rainbow stone arrow. Aha, so you can alleviate impending blood loss. Soft cotton reduces fall damage and sound. Interesting. And uh, what else was it? This thing. What is this? Tipped with rainbow stone shard. Colored light shines at the point of impact. Oh, it's cool. I don't know what purpose I would have for it, but cool nonetheless. Okay, what's over here? 
Random beetle, don't really care about that. Because I have all this stuff. Ooh, secret, secret area. Where are we? Okay, we're back west of the bridge. far no resistance on this path I think I found some resistance not very much though okay, got that taken care of what's next where are we now oh we're Probably can't get down, though. Should uh, drink a flask. Okay, we're deep into unknown territory. Lierna of the Lakes. Is there. Uh, whatchamacallit? A Lost Grace. I would think there would be somewhere. Yep, there it is. Okay, so we got a whole new area in this direction. Gosh, this game, it already feels too big. Um, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna level up, I need 2600. Auto refill on? What does that mean? So if I store some... Wasn't someone talking about auto using those or something? Help. Menu explanation. Okay, that's not exactly... Yeah, that's not helpful. Um... So if I store all of those... Okay, they still can't be auto-spent. So I gotta go out here to use the runes, and I needed 2,500, and I have 700. What's that? 1,800? Let's see what this big one is. Oh, I didn't see it before. There's text. Golden rune 1, 2, 3, 5. 2 is 800, so 5 is probably enough, right? Yeah, five is 1,600. Okay. And then I need one of these, and I'm either just enough or barely short. Barely short. Crap. All right, one more. Okay, level up. 
And I'm between intelligence and mind. Uh, or even strength. Heck, I could even use more health. Um, crap, crap, crap. What to do, what to do. Or endurance. Gosh. This is the problem with doing melee and magic, is you just have so many things you want to level up. But I'm going to do mind. It's done. And I guess I'll explore this way a little bit, but I really need to get into the castle there. But that stupid boss is eating my lunch. But I may just need to defeat him. Try, try again until I win. What I'm hoping for, or what I was hoping for, I guess, with all this exploration, was to find an upgrade for my flasks. But I don't think that's happened. Maybe if I clear out this area, maybe that'll... Because we can summon wandering nobles here. Oh, no. Ow, ow, ow. Excuse me. Wow, that's pretty rough. Oh, that was supposed to hit you. And I'm dead. Nope, I'm not dead. How did that hit me? Are you kidding me? Crap. Okay. Well, I'm gonna try that again. Because I don't know what happened there. Ah, I need to roll forward through those little firefly things if I get hit again. Okay, so I grab this. Now I'm going to try the other. There's wolves and a spirit jellyfish. FP cost 31. These cost the most, so I wonder if they're the best. But let's try the jellyfish. You only get one of them. Oh, that's helpful. That should help with him being dead. Nice and distracting. Okay. We shall keep... Keep killing. Come on, jellyfish. We've got killing to do. Is it easy? Charge up. Got him. Cuckoo glint stone. Oh crap! Oh, they got me. Thank goodness for my jellyfish. So far, the jellyfish has proved pretty helpful. Okay, what's this? Glintstone Craftsman's Cookbook. Secret item, smoldering butterfly. Wow, six of them, but not, uh, not all that special. I already had like 30.
Okay, now did I get a refill? I did. Did get a refill. Alright. Let's horse up here and uh, find out. Is there anything else? There's a skull over here. Grab a golden rune. And what else we got? There's a big swamp. Not really too excited to go into that right now. There's another Lost Grace here. And maybe another merchant? Where even am I? Okay, we're north of the castle. You're new around. Surprised you found Yes, me. I am new around here. Why don't you oh, don't ask me? Oh, I won't ask you how you got your stuff. He sells an S stock, which is interesting. I already have one of those. Apparently they're worth a lot. Astrologer's staff. Kite shield. And a bunch of astrologer stuff. A lantern you can attach to your waist to eliminate. And a warrior's cookbook that costs 1500 gives me crystal dart, spellproof dried liver, and shatter shard arrow. Now this thing is sorcery scaling 60. Which I think is the thing that matters. Um... And what's the one that I currently have? Sorcery scaling 113. Oh. Then what is the... What is the purpose of... This? What am I missing? I don't totally understand what I'm missing. I'm pretty sure it's a terrible weapon. It does 25 damage. Huh. I'm missing, I'm missing uh, what the purpose of that is. It seems horrible to me. But maybe I'm missing something. Okay. Uh, I think the last thing I want to do before I go defeat the boss is we're going to go level up our weapons. And we are going to fight that stupid boss until we win. We are going to play Dark Souls the way it's meant to be played. Dying over and over and over and over again. Is it this way? Well, let me check. Was there anything I needed to do with these? Oh, wait, no. Bell bearing. I don't have that. Oh, I did want the longbow. Okay. 1,200. How many souls do I... Do I even have enough? Yeah, I probably haven't. That's 1,400 right there. So, 1,200 is going to be... Let's use four. Okay, talk to you. Purchase. And I would like a longbow. Sometimes bow and arrow strategies are also pretty good. <gasps> Wait, how did you get here? Greetings. My name is Roderick. Isn't this the round table hold? Covert quarters yes. of the two fingers. Gathering place of champions. Why to, to become Elden Lord? Bestowed upon us tarnished. Had such fantastic roots. Although, it's all a bit much for me, in truth. I'm still looking. It's all a bit. I'm still looking. So wait, is that the is that the person this dude wanted me to find? Could have sworn I maybe I had to find this place she first and then talk to her. She's been my counsel, nope. Honestly. That's not who he was looking for. Okay, so she's just here now, but I don't know what for. Okay, now you, sir. Strengthen arm about Roderica. She's crestfallen and can scarcely swing a blade. But she has a gift. 
for spirit tuning. I saw another one like her. Spirit long tuning. Ago. Their eyes share the same hue. Okay, interesting. Still don't know how any of that matters, but I do need a strength and damage here. And then I need 836 to upgrade those again. So I'll use Golden Ring 3. I'll use that one. And then all three of those. Okay, so we'll upgrade our Great Sword one more time. I mean, that makes a huge difference, right? Adding another 10 damage a total of like 20 more damage on each hit and then this will give me slightly higher sorcery scaling it's not much but it'll add up over time it's those little incremental bonuses it's all a bit and i'm still looking for tell her what the blacksmith tell said me, yes you possess a gift talent, and goodness knows it would be my first I suppose I should try to hope I'll ask yeah. Master Hugh. Certainly he does appear intimidating and holds no love for us tarnished. I know he's trapped here at the round table hold. So I can tell. If I do, I suppose I should try to ask Master. Okay, so I assume maybe I can just leave and come back and she'll have figured that out. Let's find out. Because I'm curious what that is. Or it's possible. A certain amount of in-game time has to pass. I don't actually know. But we're gonna try it. Let's go back. Um, yeah, I still don't know where I'm supposed to get extra sorceries. Uh, but I want to do none of those things. I need to go to the map. Stance broken. Critical hit. Critical hit. Oh, I didn't know you could get a critical hit on stance broken enemies. If I do, I suppose I should ask my... Okay. Maybe it's a certain amount of time before she figures that, that out. Alright. It's time. It's time to win. Ain't no, ain't no turning back anymore. We are in it until we defeat him. This could take a while. So I have to decide what... First of all, I don't think the darts are going to behoove me, so I'm going to... Oops. Uh, I want to unequip them so that they don't get in the way of me swapping potions. And the longbow could be equipped. It would put me to heavy load, though. Maybe that's why I should have a short bow. Hmm. I don't think a bow and arrow is going to help me a ton with this guy. But I am going to want that eventually. Alright, we are going to go 2-3 for now. And... I don't have sacred tears. I would really like a sacred tear though. Also, let's remove that. Okay, let's try again. And am I allowed to use the jellyfish? I am. Equip a bow, two arrows, precision aiming. So I should have been doing this the whole time. It might distract him a little bit. Yep, it will. That's extremely helpful.
Thou art of passing skill. Warrior blood must truly run in thy veins. Tarnished. It sure does. That jellyfish is gonna make this possible. Wow, I barely dodged that in time. Okay, I'm out of out of FP for the rest of the battle. Oh, and a bit. Cool. All right, jellyfish does very little damage, but it's a tank. Let's try the other. Let's try the swarm of dudes, and then after that, we'll try the wolves. Yeah, I'm still not sure if I was able to do this before and I just wasn't trying or if I needed the bell that the witch lady gave me at the merchant, which was off of YouTube video, but I went at nighttime to the church place and she gave me the bell. I don't know if the nighttime was the the reason that it worked or what, but yeah, let's let's try a different Let's actually try the wolves. See what that does for me. They are doing a lot more damage than the jellyfish did. Ouch. Good hit. I didn't know you could break him. Stagger. Oh, that hurt. Okay, there goes the last wolf. Oh, I don't have enough to summon him back. Stress. Stress. I have no flasks left. Crap. Crap. It's combos. Dang it. Dang it. Dang it. Dang it. Ah. Okay. Well, I'm confident we can win with these spirits helping out. I was uh, going to struggle a lot more without that. So the last thing to try is the swarm of undead peasants. Let's see if those are any better. I also think I should allocate one more because just summoning... Um, summoning these dudes to be meat shields has been pretty effective so far. So then, let's try to do that there. I don't know exactly how this works, because if it's not in my... How do you use it? If... Do you just go over there and hit use? Yeah, okay. Okay, let's try the nobles here. Oh, they're gonna die way faster, aren't they? Ah, I always screw that up.
did not roll soon enough. Please be distracted for a minute. Okay, one more. Oh my gosh. I just dodged too soon so often with this guy. Oh no, okay. I wanna, yeah, kill that last guy and then can I summon them again? No? Only one summon per, cause I have the FP. I can take like 10 more damage or I'm dead. There it is. Okay. So, Wandering Nobles, not as good as the Wolves. I think the Wolves might be the sweet spot. The Jellyfish was tanky, but it did very, very little damage. So, I think I might do the Wolves. Alright. So, over here, change to wolves. And then I guess I should just have the other two kind of chill in there so I can use those when necessary. Go through, summon wolves immediately. Okay, no more magic. Class. Well, lag. Big lag. Okay. Well, at least we blocked it. Stop coming for me! Fight the wolves! There we go. Fight the wolves. My friend, fight the wolves. Where I'm never gonna avoid that attack once. It's just so slow. I'm never ready for how slow it is. Alright, is this it? Can we do it? He's almost dead. The wolf is uh, getting in there for a couple more bites, and the wolf. Is oh my gosh, I just need one hit. One hit. No stress, no stress. Yes! Yes! Oh, thank goodness for those wolves. Bam! Talisman pouch. Okay. Okay, that was intense. Let's level up our mind to 15. Intelligence to 15 and maybe chill there. And what is the talisman pouch? Oh, okay, that just lets me equip another talisman. That would put me at heavy load, so I'm not going to. And finally, we can make progress. Stormvale Castle. Oh boy. 
Let's see what's up here. Okay, we definitely have to go down there. Let me grab this uh, Lost Grace first. And then there's stairs down this way with an item. Something's about to kill me. Oh, I saw a shadow. That's just the, the flag up there. <laughs> I assume that was the shadow of something that was ambushing me. Okay, I think that's all that is. Or wait, I can go down here. Secrets? Anyone? Anyone? Secrets? Fire grease. I think that allows me to temporarily apply fire damage to my weapon. Trina's Lily. Okay, doesn't seem to be anything else over here. Doo -doo -doo. Anything on this corner? Nope, just certain death. I've gone that way before to avoid the guy. I'm very curious about that now. Or no, he was on the other side of that wall. Never mind. Okay, so that's uh all there was to do in that direction. I assume I can't just open this. Yeah. We're gonna have to fight out fight our way through. You there. Come over here, would you? I don't trust you, but uh sure. You are you, tarnished, aren't you? I am. I would advise against taking the main gate into the castle. Okay. It's tightly guarded by hardened old hands. Oh, Try the opening right here. The guards don't know about it. You'll breach the castle undetected. Fine. Yes, that's the spirit. You're just the kind of tarnished that I like. I feel like I'm being manipulated. I pray for your success. Doubt it. it the guards, you'll slip. So wait, could I have used the main gate? I'm confused. The main gate doesn't open. Is there a lever or something that I just missed and I can go through the main gate? Maybe there's a lever in here that I could then go through the main gate. But I feel like he's talking about this opening and I'm not understanding the choice that he's claiming I have. So let's investigate a bit more. What did I miss? I don't see a lever. Um, interesting. Also, can I jump up here? I always forget that I can jump. Oh, I can, but there's nothing. Huh. So, what? Super confused. Because everything in me is telling me I should be able to go through the main gate right now. but I can't. Also, there's a Lost Grace up there. I can see the bottom of it. <laughs> um, okay, so I think I go this... Oh, there's an item. A golden rune. 200 measly runes. Okay, we're gonna walk with our shield up here.
I hear... Yep, there's something bad. Whoa. Swordfoot Hawk? Okay, that's new. Why do you have swords on your feet? Whoa. Jeez. This thing is intense. Intense and dead. Wow. It's a little steampunky compared to usual. Okay, can I like go around? Is there super secret stuff over here? It might be. I really want to jump down there. But first, let's explore whatever else is in this area. Like a lost grace, perhaps? And I can't jump up here. Can I mount? Nope, can't mount up in here. Okay, so I'm going to try going this way. Okay, yeah, that's where we were before. By the front gate. And there's ten bolts for the crossbow we don't own. Very grateful for that. Not another bird thing. Ouch. Oh, there's two of them. That's going to be way worse for me. Oh, my uh, flasks are all munged up, too. Still have four of the FP ones. Oh my gosh. These things are hard to hit, is the problem. Yep. Figured that was coming. Alright. I need to try a little harder with those guys. I also need to reallocate my flasks. Alright, allocate. We're gonna go with 3 2 still. Call that a day. How'd that hit me? I felt kind of lucky. Um, so there's one right there. I wonder if I can ambush here. Got him. And then the other one's down there. I was not close enough. <laughs> All right, but we were able to defeat Stormhawk Feather. I wonder what that is. Is that a crafting thing or is that a inventory thing? It is a crafting. Okay, so we go this way. Oh, there's two more. Why is there always more? Uh, these guys are so annoying to fight. Oh my gosh. Classic Dark Souls, man. Classic Dark Souls. Because if you're locked onto them, you know, they're flying in circles, it's very disorienting. Which, 
I would almost argue is bad game design, but then at the same time, it's kind of like cool that they're disorienting because it almost makes some amount of sense. But can I sneak and find... Where is this first one? Oh, well, he found me. Okay. So number one down. Number two, I can snipe from here. Dang it. Didn't finish him off. Wait, you have wings, dude. Can you not fly up here? Okay, we got that one. This guy's still... Flying around over here. Get dead. Get flippin' dead. Okay, I need health. I need FP. And we're gonna get bodied by the two hawks over here again, but... Where was the first one? Oh, he's up in the tree. Oh, there's two in the tree. No wonder. We never had a chance. Two for you, two for you, two for you. I think I only ended up killing one of them with- wait, those didn't even hit? Oh jeez, I'm screwed. I'm screwed. I don't know when I have a time to attack back. Oh, I have the wrong thing. I don't even have my sword. Okay. Now. Now. Die. Die. Okay. Sheesh. I'm really lucky this other guy didn't attack me. Grab my runes here. I should have done that earlier. It was a risky battle. Three smithing stones. That's awesome. Stormhawk down, and Kydax stressed. <sighs> Alright, now this is a different path. There's still a path right by the Lost Grace that I haven't taken. But I, I needed to explore all this. Okay, that's actually just the cliff here. Can I get up this way? Surely I can get up here somehow. No? Can't. Interesting. That feels attainable. Maybe it's not. Oh, I can get up this way. Okay. Secrets. Give me something good. Please, oh please. Okay. One single herba. Not a great reward. That's really all I get. Come on now. Surely there's something else up here. Nothing? Secret door? No? That's really it. That's all we're gonna get. Or can we, like, climb all the way up this tower or something stupid like that? That would kind of be hilarious if that's true. Yeah, I don't think so. Okay, well... Felt clever for finding my way up here, but uh, apparently the game designers don't agree. Alright, we've figured that path out, now we're gonna go down this path. And I probably should level up, because I'm only 70. 
runes away from leveling up. I don't know what to start leveling, though, is the problem. I feel like I'm going to need a better weapon at some point. So strength is probably a safe, safe thing to level up here. Never go wrong with strength. When you are a sword wielder. Okay. No, thank you. No, you didn't need to do that. Stop it, please. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Take that. And get front stabbed. Oh yeah, I forgot, I get health with that. I need to find out uh, how much health that gives me. A marred leather shield, surely that's horrible. It's good for lightning protection, I guess? Causes blood loss buildup. Wait, so if I equip it, it will make... No, surely. That's not what it does, right? No, I guess that's for my enemies. Probably. Also, I could, I think, take parry off of this shield so it wouldn't... Um, so it would let me do my sword skill. And that's probably a good idea, because I never parry anything, because I'm horrible at it. Absolutely. Oh, that was expected, wasn't it? Okay, whatever. I'll avoid you for now. Kill you guys. Up or flat first. I'll go straight. I'm still confused on why that guy was telling me, like, hey, don't go in the main gate. You'll die. I didn't have a choice. Ouch. Yeah, I just didn't have a choice in the matter, so that was very, very confusing. Hook claws. Sounds like a weapon for someone. I keep going to crafting instead of equipment. I don't know if that's muscle memory from Dark Souls 3 or what, but... Causes blood loss buildup. Okay. And yeah, high dexterity weapon. I'm just curious what this... uh. Oh, interesting. It doesn't use any stamina to attack. Or is that just... No, that's how the game works when you're not in combat. Interesting. So out of combat, you have infinite stamina. Just kidding. I kind of figured something like that would happen. Excuse me. I would like you to not... Oh, yeah, wait, I keep meaning to uh, test this theory. You hurt me. Okay, good, thank you. Excuse me. All right, I need to backstab you. Dang it! Ah. Commoner's headband altered. What does altered mean? It's very light for how much mag uh, you know, magical damage types that blocks. Or amount of magical damage. Gosh dang it, I wanted to see how much health I get back from a critical hit there. This feels like an ambush. 
but it's not question mark i guess okay door locked can i see very much in there can't really see anything all right moving forward stormvale castle okay maybe i can back backstab you please There we go. Oh, come on. Can't get in the right spot. Wow. Literally the easiest, oh, there we go. Easiest dude to backstab in the world and I can't do it. Offers literally zero threat. Can I get up here? No. Keep forgetting to blink. Oh my goodness. Is there light? Oh, there's an item up there. Okay. Up the stairs we go. There's an item down there. I can backstab you, presumably. Now we can watch our health. Wow. That's actually quite a bit of health. It's like 50 to 100 health right there. A golden rune two, which is 400 runes we have learned. Do, 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 do. Up the stairs we go. Can't fit in there. Probably can't jump up there. Doesn't seem to be anything I can do from up here. I mean, I could... Oh, crap. I see it. I see it. I see the secret. How many times am I going to fall, though, is the question. Because we have to make a jump. So we go up here. Run all the way around. And then we have to jump into that hole. I can probably just jump from here. Yeah. St. Trina's arrow. Oh, and there's this turd burglar that we can send to his demise. Not the only one though. Some health back, please. Oh, there's another one. Okay. So that actually gives me a new path here. Or no, it doesn't. Okay. This just kind of drops me where I already was. All right, um, as far as I can tell, this is the only path forward. Ooh, cutscene. Oh, what was that cutscene for? It's so dark. So flippin' dark. Oh no! I didn't release my attack early enough. I thought I had him on the ropes. I was charging up my heavy swing and then I was maybe gonna guard break him and then I could go critical hit. Uh, okay, this feels like Dark Souls right here. So I think it's the, the sections like this that are gonna feel kind of like the old linear gameplay for a little while. Oh my gosh. 
Okay. No, don't fall off, please. I need some help back. Oh, item. What do you got? What do you got? Exile Greaves. Um, they're all heavy load. I don't have room for more Greaves right now. All right. Getting firebombed. Or we'll just die. I guess those were explosive barrels. Dang, I lost my thousand souls from before. That's fine. A thousand is not very much. I've lost quite a few more than that in Dark Souls. It's really bad when you've been going time and time again and you have you know, three or four levels worth of souls, and then you just lose it all. It always hurts a lot. Get wrecked. Guys are not a threat. Easy, 120 souls. Avoid that stuff. I don't know how that didn't kill me the first time, to be honest. doesn't have enough health to get staggered by that. So I do need a backstab to get some health back. Okay, keep going. Backstab you. Item. Of course you would drop an item. Weathered straight sword. Can I make this jump? I can't. It's just worse than uh than the Lord Sworn straight sword, so that's just gonna be something I sell later. But it's nice to have souls in a form that I'm not gonna lose when I die. Alright, back in here, fight the big knight, that's gonna wreck me. Where you at, my friend? There you are. Oh, the wind. Nice, get a backstab going. Okay, here we go. Let's try this again. Hold, and there it is. That's what I wanted to do before. Get the attack up. Okay, that was not too bad. Not too bad. Now, a torch would be nice, would it not? No. No, no, no. Do not lose all runes. Memory of Grace. Okay, I did not uh, quite realize what I had going on there. This is going to get me to heavy load, which is probably bad, but uh, we need to see. Okay, Rusty Key probably unlocks the door from earlier. Fat roll our way through all this garbage. Now, is this a mimic? That's my question. There's no chain anywhere on it. 
Cursed sword, curved sword talisman. That enhances guard counters. I wish I knew what a guard counter was. I think a guard counter is when I block something and then hit the heavy attack. I think. But I'm not actually 100% sure of that. So then it's down here, I assume, is where our key opens the door to. Yep. And then maybe a Lost Grace? I'm hoping for a Lost Grace soon. I always look around myself when I climb a ladder. So many hidden, hidden things in these games. Okay, so now we're up here. Kill you. There's an item up there, item over here. Right. Oh. Get over there. I'm gonna guess I have to jump onto that beam down there. I'll try that in a second. I don't think I can make this jump. No, I can't. So, first we'll go back here. Wow, you did so much damage with your little assassination attempt there. You made me far more scared than I needed to be. This seems to be leading into a whole new area. Let me check for, see if there's a Lost Grace. Kind of just up the stairs here. Three mushrooms. Nope, there's another big knight. So we're gonna go back and try all the the jumping shenanigans over here. Nothing in this corner? Dang. Okay, jumping shenanigans. Step one, don't die. Step two, jump, so oh, well, uh, apparently step one is fall into the hole. What are we at for the recording? An hour and 24 minutes. I maybe should call it, but we're gonna try this stuff first. Because I'm having fun. And if you're watching this on YouTube, you're not watching, oh, I just hit the wrong button to jump. That's okay, third time's the charm. If you're watching this on YouTube, you're not like, oh man. Why is the episode stopping? Because at this point you're just invested in watching me play Elden Ring. So here we are. All right, let's try the actual jump button this time. There we go. Now this is likely to not work. Ha ha, oh my gosh. Um, what did that accomplish for me? That still doesn't let me get over there. Does it? So I actually don't think that did anything for me. I must get that another way. I have to be up there for this. How do I get up there? 
Because, yeah, that item's going to... Up there. Interesting. Hmm. How do I do that? So I'll go back up these gates. Maybe I can go from up here down around the edge. Maybe this is it. Yeah, this is it. Bingo. Ar Arteria leaf. How do I get over to there, though? Even that feels tricky. This is... Oh, I jump over there? No, this is where I've been before. Oh, I just need to jump over here. And this will get me to that other item. Okay. Guard break on myself. Gotta watch out for the No Whoops. Okay. That's not good. Pro tip, don't fall to your doom. Man, he really is all about that, that horn. Try to not get destroyed by fire pots. to backstab. There we go. Thank you for providing me with such a thing. Take care of you. You give me another backstab back to full health. Don't need to go in there. Oh, I didn't need to come up here either. This is already open. Back up the stairs. Or ladder, I guess. These are not stairs. You try to kill me, but that doesn't work. Some easy souls there. There's nobody up here. Wait, did we go this way? Yeah, there's not uh not anything down there. Okay. Now what I learned is I actually need to go this way. That was close. So there are my runes over there. Okay, 
I need to jump. Ugh, failure. How do I get up there again? Do I have to take the ladder, or can I get up there without the ladder? I can't remember. I think that's the ladder. But I didn't need to go around the front. That's what I just screwed up. And I'm getting close, if I can get my runes back, to another level. So I maybe should level up before I lose all my runes. Okay, so I jump over here. Collect my runes before this dude can kill me again. This is where the item is. Brick hammer. What's that look like? It is 31 strength required. Holy cow. High attribute scaling with strength though. And then this seems to just drop me back down to where we started. Okay. So we have done everything there is to do that I can see at least. So now we gotta keep going up. And hopefully find a lost grace after this black knight. He's just chilling here. He doesn't have a shield, so I'm gonna start with that. And back step. Oh, I don't have my weapon. Crap. There we go. That'll do it. That'll do it. Nice. Get wrecked. Okay, I'm ready for a lost grace now. No? Definitely not here. This is an elevator of some sort that if I jump down, I die. Stairs. There's a lever that I should probably. Oh. Contraption does not move. That contraption does not move. Okay, that's also a death fall. Hmm. Oh, there we go, there we go. Ta-da! Okay, well, I think I'm gonna have to call it a YouTube video here, but we've made some good progress in Stormvale Castle. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know what you think down in the comments below, and I'll see you guys next time.